Today we will talk about the OC Sharp short range distance sensor. We will introduce the three operating modes and their applications. The OC Sharp is only available as set. The set consists of one or two sensor heads and a sensor unit. Both components are connected via an optical fiber. Various sensor heads can be used interchangeably on the sensor unit, but only one sensor head can be attached at a time. By changing the sensor head, you have the option of covering different measuring ranges and performance levels. The sensor heads contain no moving parts or electronic components that could act as a heat source and thereby influence the precision and stability. In order to measure a distance, a surface must be brought into the sensor head's measurement range. The measurement distance to the object surface is specified by the sensor head. If the device is set for mode 1, this display will appear after the device is activated. The left bar diagram shows the intensity of the measurement signal in a logarithmic scale. The right bar diagram shows the current measured distance in micrometer. This mode can be used to measure a surface topography or to perform a roughness measurement. In mode 2, the thickness of transparent material can be measured. If both boundary layers of this film are in the sensor head's measurement range, after the mode is selected and the material dependent refraction index is typed in, the display indicates the thickness of the layer in micrometer. With the mode 2 and the chromatic sensor heads from SIC, layers down to 30 micrometer thickness can be measured. Typical examples for this mode are the measurement of transparent layers and the thickness measurement of glass. If thinner layers should be measured, the interferometric sensor head and the mode 3 should be used. If the device is set to mode 3, then this display will appear after the device is activated. Next to the intensity and the layer thickness, the quality of the strongest measured signal is displayed. The interferometric measurement does not just enable to measure the thickness of a single transparent layer, such as film or coat, but also the thickness of a system of layers. Along with the necessary transparency of the layers, it is also important that the refractive index between the layers differs. 